Now let us move on to the first question in the exercise. The question is to prove that root 5 is irrational. So let's move on to the solution. So to prove root 5 is irrational, let us assume the contrary. That is root 5 is rational. Since root 5 is rational, it can be expressed in the form of p by q. Therefore, root 5 can be written as p upon q, where p and q are co primes. From this expression, we have p is equal to root 5 times q. Now squaring on both sides we have p square is equal to 5 q square. Let this be equation 1. Since 5 divides p square 5 also divides p. Therefore 5 is a factor of p. Since 5 is a factor of p p can be expressed as 5 times of c where c is some constant. Now we square this equation that is p square is equal to 25 c square. Now we shall substitute the equation p square is equal to 25 c square in equation 1. So we have 25c square is equal to 5q square. So 5 goes in 25 5 times. This implies 5c square is equal to q square. From this equation we have 5 divides q square which also implies that 5 divides q. Therefore 5 is a factor of q. Therefore, we have obtained two statements. From those, we can conclude that 5 is a factor of both P and Q. This brings a contradiction to our assumption that P and Q are co-primes. This is because of our wrong assumption that root 5 is a rational number. Therefore, root 5 is an irrational number.